All right, so welcome back everybody to today's episode of In the Pro Shop. Today's episode is going to be just a little bit different than the previous episodes. Um, so today, for this episode, uh, I'm going to be interviewing three people and asking them two primary questions about the mental game that helps them. So the first question is, uh, what is one thing that you do during a tournament to stay mentally focused? And then the second question is, what's one thing that you do throughout the day before the tournament starts uh, to become mentally focused or mentally prepare yourself for the tournament? So I'm going to be asking three people, and those three people are going to be Gabriela Hernandez, who works here in the pro shop with me at Fusion Alley Pro Shop, and also I'm going to be asking Jared Freed, who is a varsity bowler here at Ottawa University, and I'm also going to be asking Jerry Jennings, who also bowls here at Ottawa University, and he got first place at this year's uh, team trials uh, for us at Ottawa University. And so with these three people, uh, my main gauge is to try and get uh, three specific uh, and different perspectives on the same questions to help uh, the audience, you guys, to understand more about the mental game and uh, for you guys to choose or maybe uh, get a little bit of everybody's uh, opinion on how to better your game and be mentally prepared during and before tournaments. So stay tuned for the rest and I will have those interviews right here for you guys. And be sure to uh, subscribe below, leave a comment if you have future topics that you want me to talk about here on In The Pro Shop, and leave a like uh, on this video if you enjoyed it. So thanks so much guys, and here's the interviews with those three bowlers. So basically the way I set myself up for a tournament is um, I first start by waking up in the morning and just taking a deep breath and realizing that this day may get stressful at some point and that I'm just going to have to tough through it and grind things out when it gets to that point. Um, I like to have breakfast, not something too heavy, um, drink some water and basically just try and relax myself before I go into the struggle of the day or the great things that may be coming. So when it comes to staying focused in a tournament, um, I really just, again, like I like to breathe and make sure I'm not overstressing myself about every little thing. I like to take it frame by frame, um, not try not to overthink everything. And I don't necessarily try to limit my talking to people, but if I am going to be talking to someone, I like to make sure it's related to what's going on with the bowling so that I can stay in the game and really just keep my head in the right space. So one of my keys to uh, becoming mentally prepared for a tournament is just having confidence in myself and confidence in my shot making, my technique. That's one of the biggest keys in bowling in general. And I can tell anybody to be confident in their self. But if they're not, then they, their game is not going to succeed. They will not go up. They will, they will just stay at the level they're at or possibly go down. Um, one of the things I do to become mentally prepared is I'll tell myself, like before a shot or before a tournament, I need to make good shots. I need to execute. I need to throw the ball right. You know, don't, don't gas the ball. That's, what, that's a problem that I have. Uh, keep my feet slow. So, just one of the biggest things is just, for me, is confidence in general. One key for me when I'm bowling to be successful is to stay in the moment and I just gotta take it one shot at a time. And if I do make a bad shot, I gotta leave it in the past and move on from it and make a better shot the next one. Before a tournament, I usually just, I put my phone away I stay focused on what I need to do that day, make sure I know good layout, make good shots, got the right ball in the hand, that's about it. Any other shots,